as a stunt performer, you get to don the character, you get to hide behind that. Um, it's a little bit full on, when it's all about me.com. Um, but I'm embracing it as best I can, and uh, hopefully the message that I project after this film is just hope, positivity, and the fact that life's ultimately not fair, but it's the way you see it determines your outcome. So I had to be convinced. I started off trying to highlight the stunt performers with the Cunning Stunts podcast series, me and, me and Daniel did, but um, I was convinced by Dan and my director and the producers and uh, to you know turn the camera on me and focus on my journey so yeah i was really nervous but we're here now and hopefully we put it out in the world and it brings some positivity to life um, obviously there's a lot of reflecting yeah, in this film wasn't there and uh, i watched it and you know seeing all of those uh, behind the scenes footage of yourself and, and your uh, fellow stuff people doing what we thought was daniel was actually you guys yeah um how do you feel watching those kind of things back now uh nothing but pride like my contribution to those films albeit 10 seconds long or 15 seconds across the franchise i know that harry potter means a lot to a lot of people there are people watching that film in some really bad situations in life right now and I take great comfort from the fact that those people are you know my 15 seconds is contributing to that story and that safe space for them um, obviously there's uh, many interviews with Daniel with this and then this and he talks about you being his big brother on set essentially and so as his big brother how is your relationship these days he's one of my best friends we share our best and worst moments in life together so like I say everyone got to watch that young man grow up in camera I get to see him grow up as a man behind which I'm very fortunate about I love him to pieces I'm extremely proud of him and uh, being his gymnastics coach throughout the Potter franchise I can vicariously live through the way his physicality is and some of the stuff he does on stage or in front of camera so I'm really thankful. Well you said that you saw him on Broadway the other day and you, you know you were going to teach him his physicality do you sometimes be like to a friend and be like talk him that? Uh, funny enough I when he come off stage the other day I was like good tuck good tuck jump so yeah really good it's really nice and uh, I He's just, uh, you know, I try not to bring the highlight onto myself. I'm just really proud of him and uh, really fortunate to have him in my life.